What's up, Royal Spartan Tribe? This is Royal Spartan 125 back for yet another great reaction. Okay, this is top 10 historical objects ruined by morons. It's by watchmojo.com. This is not a request a video, it's just what I'm doing live on stream that I picked myself. Just, you know, out of the blue, this is the last video. Of the night, and uh, yeah, just looks like it could be fun. I'll put it that way. All right, if you want me to react to any other video, just leave it in the comments section down below, and I'll get to it as soon as I can. I'll be leaving links in the description down below for this video on this channel, and check out my links while you're there as well. Yeah, okay, let's jump in. They survived the ravages of time but not acts of stupidity. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 historical objects ruined by morons. Before we begin, <laughs> we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. For this list, we're looking at iconic or valuable objects and things from the past that have been broken, damaged, or completely destroyed by inane decisions. Number 10, the Chinese vase. Ever looked at Chinese porcelain hundreds of years old and thought, man, this would sure make a nice table lamp? Well, that's what must have happened before someone drilled a hole in this Qing Dynasty vase to push oh. an electrical cable through. Decades later, a woman who had inherited the vase took it to be valued, only to be told that the hole had dramatically decreased its value, down from a potential 50,000 pounds to a few thousand. So before repurposing oh, some pissed. old vase that's been lying around the house forever, go get an appraisal. Number 9. The Statue of the Two Hercules yes. We've seen a spate of selfie mishaps in the early 21st century, from costly accidents to tragic deaths. It seems like people will do anything to get the perfect snap. A 300-year-old statue featuring two depictions of Hercules has long been a symbol of the city of Cremona, Italy. Oh. But the legendary hero's statue was no match for the selfie obsession of two tourists who decided to climb it for a quick photo. The men toppled and shattered the marble crown on the emblem held by the pair of Hercules figures. And unfortunately, this wasn't even the first time holidaymakers have damaged historical Italian monuments. It's like a historical piece. Why, why do you need your name in it? You didn't build it. Number 8. The Star-Spangled Banner It was like a fireworks display. People who watched it were enthralled. At the Battle of Baltimore during the War of 1812, the British Navy bombarded American forces at Fort McHenry through the night. Detained on a British troop ship, American poet Francis Scott Key watched in dismay as the heavens seemed to rain down a sea of fire. But at dawn, an enormous American flag was raised defiantly over the fort, a moment that inspired him to pen the American national anthem. This iconic oh. flag came into the possession of one Georgiana Armistead Appleton, who cut off snippets as gifts before the remains were whisked away to safety by the Smithsonian oh. Institution. It sort of freezes them for a moment, and that's a, a truly wonderful thing. Number 7. The 5,000-Year-Old Cave Painting Thousands of years ago, one of our ancestors drew this mysterious long-armed figure in Los Escolares Cave in oh. southern Spain. Hidden away from modern eyes until its rediscovery in 1973, it withstood the ravages of time for millennia as civilizations rose and fell. But it couldn't survive the shoddy work of thieves, who in 2014 sheared away part of the artwork in an oh. attempt to steal it. This is a huge blow, as the damage is irreparable. But it also points out another problem. Although the cave system housing the picture is listed as a UNESCO World Heritage Site, there's no practical way to protect it against such acts. Number 6. The Senator It's part of our um history as a family. It was one of the oldest trees in the world, predating Jesus by 1,500 years. What? This bald cypress towered 125 feet high in Big oh. Tree Park, Florida, and was a landmark for Native Americans and early settlers. But in 2012, 26-year-old Sarah Barnes, who proclaimed herself a, quote, nature enthusiast on her modeling page, lit a fire to better see the methamphetamine she was about to smoke. Things got a little out of hand, oh, you and today, a charred stump of wood is all that remains. Number 5. The Monet Painting Ever struggled to get art? Maybe Irish vandal Andrew Shannon felt frustrated about a Claude Monet painting hanging in the National Gallery of Ireland in Dublin. 
Valued at 10 million euros, the impressionist Ooh. work Argenteuil Basin with a single sailboat depicts an idyllic scene on the Seine River. But it apparently enraged Shannon, who in 2012 punched oh. a hole right through the canvas. He initially told cops he was trying to, quote, get back at the state, but would claim in court that it was an accident and that he stumbled due to a health condition. Witnesses no. claimed otherwise, and he served five years in the slammer. Thankfully, five years, that's the painting all? was later restored after 18 painstaking months of work. Uh, DJ Fashion says, "What? Why? Why the heck would you burn down, burn the oldest tree in the world down?" She didn't mean to do it. That's the worst part. She was she 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 thought she was like one of these like nature lovers. You know what I mean? Oh, I love trees and make love, not war, and all that kind of stuff. Yeah. But she was smoking meth, or she was about to smoke meth, and she couldn't see it. Must have been dark. So she lit a fire so she, she could see her drugs better, and the tree caught fire. And that's it. Oh, people are just stupid, man. And pissing he served me off, five man. years in the slammer. This video was Thankfully, pissing me the off. painting was later restored after 18 painstaking <sighs> months of work. Number 4. The El Paraíso Pyramid This pyramid would sure make a great spot for a swimming pool. Well, maybe that's what property developers were thinking what? when they illegally bulldozed a 20-foot-tall, 4,000-year-old pyramid at El Paraíso, Peru. Oh. They then lit the remains on fire for good measure. The site is one of the oldest and largest archaeological what? sites in Peru. As a matter of fact, it predates the rise of the famous Incan Empire. Oh Onlookers prevented them from destroying other pyramids, and the developers were hit with criminal charges. Each one of these pyramids is part of my life. Now we'll never know all the history in that pyramid. Number 3. Chilean Geoglyphs The Dakar Rally, the annual off-road race where affluent drivers tear through untouched wilds. Before moving to South America in 2009, the rally took place in Africa, where it attracted criticism for its impact on locals and the environment. Archaeologists in Chile have also condemned the event. The route through the Atacama Desert oh, damaged no. protected sites, including ancient geoglyphs, which are works of art that are carved into the ground. Some of these are well over a thousand years old. It doesn't seem to matter to these off-road enthusiasts, some of whom think nothing of driving across these priceless artifacts from another era. Number 2. The God Belize Pyramid people, Belize is rich with relics left by the Mayans, whose civilization flourished in Central America for centuries until beginning a serious decline after 950 AD. But in 2013, the country lost one of these riches when construction crews oh. used the stones of an ancient pyramid for road fill. The pyramid, called what? Mamul and built in 250 BC, stood almost 60 feet tall, but was quickly broken down by the crew, the members of which were later charged and fined. Such destruction isn't fine? uncommon in Belize, That's all lion got, mounds are tempting targets for construction workers. This is an incredible, incredible destruction. Number 1. Ancient Chinese Tombs Construction Crews Strike Again in 2007, workers building an IKEA branch in Nanjing, China, destroyed 10 ancient tombs dating back almost 1,800 no. years. It was claimed that this was all a mistake and that the crews didn't know about the tombs. Okay, but in 2013, contractors working on a metro line in Guangzhou demolished imperial tombs, which had been clearly cordoned off by the Guangzhou Archaeology Research Shh. Center. Some of the tombs were 3,000 years old. Worst of all, the destruction of all these tombs is a huge loss for those seeking to better understand China's yeah. history. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from Watch Mojo and subscribe for new videos every day. Let me tell you, it's a that kid in prison. Unfortunately, not. All right, guys, that's the end of the video. I, I'm I'm speechless. My I. I <sighs> No oh, man, I love history. I'm one of those people that loves ancient history and all that. Of these idiots to come in, like especially those guys, those two men who got up on the Hercules statue and destroyed the crown. Oh, now other people will never get to enjoy it. You know what I mean?
just because they want to take a selfie with it? <sighs> no. No. They should have had someone there, a guard or something, to stop them from jumping up on it. Bet they wish to had now. Okay. Now, these people are just ignorant, man. That's all it is. Pure ignorance. That pissed me off. <laughs> I thought this one would be fun. I thought it would be funny. But no. No. It wasn't funny. Not even close. And there's a second one? <laughs> okay. Until next time. I am out of here.